Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about fractions and decimals. And we're going to write each as a decimal, and we're going to use repeating decimals when necessary. So, if I was given this fa fraction, three-fifths, okay, we have three-fifths here, okay? So, there's a few ways we can go about it. So, if we can use long division, right, five goes into three, okay? That's one of the ways. Well, five doesn't go into three, so we add another place value here. If I say, does 5 go into 30? Well, that's evenly 6 times. 6 times 5 is 30. We subtract it. 30 minus 30 is 0. And we're done. We got our final answer, 0 0.6. That's it. Okay? Another way we could do this, right? 3 fifths, if we double that, right? If we double the numerator and denominator, so if I had 3 fifths right here, and I multiply that by 2 over 2, well, I would get 6 over 10. Okay? And 6 over 10 is the same thing as a decimal, 0.6. So some people like to you know, quickly see it that way. It's up to you. But anyway, quick recap the way we did it normally. We had 3 fifths right there. We used long division, 5 into 3, which gave us 0.6. And so again, our final answer is 0 0.6.